Yum, yum. William Vaughn here with a quick look at Tension Texture and Moto. Moto's Tension Texture is a powerful gradient that can change the attributes of a surface based on how much the surface is either compressed or stretched. Start with a mesh item that has some deformation applied to it. In this example, I'll use this leg that is deformed with a skeleton. Apply a Tension Texture layer to your material in the shader tree. Open the gradient editor for the color channel and set keys in both the positive and negative giving each key different RGB values. The positive value key will affect geometry that is expanding while the negative value key will affect geometry that is compressing. Tension texture is not limited to color variation. We can also use it as a mask. Add a crumple layer to your material, adjust the values to your liking, and set its effect to displacement. Add a tension texture to your material and group the new tension texture and the crumple layers. Change the effect of the tension texture to group mask. Open the gradient editor for the value channel. When using a tension texture as a mask, you'll need to create the gradient in the value channel instead of the color channel. Change the value of the initial key to zero. Add a new key in the negative to affect the compressed geometry and change its value to 100%. Using the tension texture as a mask limits the crumple displacement to just the areas that are compressed by the mesh's deformation. Oh, look at the time.